Hello guys, welcome back with me, Chow Chow 2025 in Persona 3 FES Answer. Oh, I guess. By the way, if you counter human like figure during the investigation, haven't you? Since you've seen it in person, can you describe it for me? All I could tell through Juno was that it seemed human. That's impossible. There's no way anyone but us could be down there. But we do keep running into it. Anyway, we're heading for the deepest part of the abyss. Once we corner it, we'll get the truth. Come on, let's go. Junpei's son never show any sign of weakness unless he's really in pain. It's actually been comforting on several occasions. The use of Junpei's son is well, it's very a comic relief. An alcoholic dad? It's not that I sympathize with Junpei, but I do understand how awful it feels like to have parents like that. Taking back, it was one hell of a coincidence that I found Junpei when I did. If I hadn't been out that night on patrol, he might have never joined Seas. I know it sounds weird to hear this from me, but it was definitely a once in a lifetime chance. We've seen Amada, Akihiko's, and now Yori's past. If I had to defy a common thread, all of the scenes were set further in the past than last year's battles. What does this all mean? Let me know if you figure anything out yourself. By the way, I use his support skill to your advantage. My persona in particular knows the number of them. The first of them is Mind Charge, a double effect of magic attack once. Next is Spirit Drain, which steal the enemies. Ask me for your own use. Finally, there's Tentra Fu, that confuse all enemies, rendering them incapable of using skill. And so on, and so forth. If you're interested in fighting strategically, leave it to me. With your video, the day is March 31st. Yeah, it's the same thing. The one named Koromaru is more reliable than he looks. His loyalty surprised me when I talked to him a moment ago. You understand him? Yes, but then again, since he's a dog, he's not really talking. But, don't you have a similar function, sister? I guess being able to communicate with animals isn't anything special. What did he say? He said it's his duty to cheer people up when they fell down. He also said that Cerebrus is good at fire and to leave fire attacks to him. Huh? But he said that you can understand him too though. Now that I think about it, are all the people outside the drum really okay? Things happen so fast, but lately I've been worried since I heard about Junpei Kun's family. I wonder if my mom and dad are alright. My dad's gotten better than he was back then, but he still falls off the wagon now and then. But you know, it's not that, so I don't really have it as bad as everyone else. Don't worry about me, man. I mean, back then, it was nothing compared to the hard water I'm in right now. Yet another reason to put me, the great Junpei Yori, on your team. I'll pull you out of any jam, no matter how bad it gets. Especially if you're just worried about fire attack. The call for good old Junpei the fireman. Okay, maybe we shop a little while. Okay, let's set up Persona first. Are you still searching for him? What? Okay, let's go.
This is it. This must be the fifth door. Are you ready? Answer. Are we going to see another pass even here? I forgot to bring people. That black shadow that appears from time to time and the past event are just really related to all being trapped in the dorm. I guess the only choice we have is to believe what Matt is saying. Worry about it won't accomplish anything. Please move on and find the truth. Wait a second. I said a strong presence. It's about four floor below your present location. Be careful. I'm sensing a strong presence below. You may have to fight immediately. After going down there, are you sure you prepared? Proceed. Adam Shadow. Incoming! Okay, like you saw. Crying table, weakness eyes, green fire. Maya, weakness fire, green eyes. And Magus, weakness fire, green wind. Table. Leave it to me. Jinpei gonna attack. This Maya. Ikari gonna do whatever she wants. Crazy experience. No. Okay, pretty easy, right? Yeah, you shit. Remember, I use shit, so don't count no. Don't count on me. This game is a waste of time. If the story wasn't that good, I'm gonna give up. But 
I'm here for the story. Yeah, I'm gonna refresh first. The atmosphere is different here. I wonder why. The lower we go, the more nervous I get. It's still far away now, but I'm sensing a strong presence below. Brace yourself for it. You're getting closer to that strong presence. It's not far away. Please don't take it lightly. That figure again. Could it have some sort of purpose here? We're about to go to the boss fight. Okay, first of all, you shouldn't bring Junpei here since the enemy gonna use Magarudine. But since I use Cheat, you know, I'm pretty confident that I can defeat the enemy. And the enemy drains order, drains all element at elemental attacks. So use your best fight directly. So Matis Akihiko is. Yes. Well, Great Junpei has a nice physical attack, but he, you know, since we get his weak against Garu, the enemy seems to be waiting below. Are you ready? Proceed. Shadow confirmed. If that presence is summoning them, does that mean it's an enemy? But it seems like... It doesn't seem like it's going to attack us this time either. Focus on the shadow. Get ready. Give me a sec. I'll scan the target. I'm gonna ice break him. Persona! Damn it. I let my guard down. Couldn't finish it off. This thing won't give up. I need your help. Yeah, using ice break also work. I couldn't finish it up. This thing won't give up. It's weakened. Please be careful. Persona. Yeah, jump is good. And it's good. Nice. My will is unfailing. Yeah, we're powered. Yeah, whatever. Nice. <laughs> nice. Okay. Let's press first, but before that Enter the third door. The last part of Ptolemia. 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 That black shadow. 
Maddie says he doesn't know what it is, but is that true? I know we have to take her word for it, but I'm still uneasy. Oh, sorry. I lost track of that black shadow. Maybe you can find clues ahead. Please, check it down. Were you able to figure out where the black figure went? Sorry, but I haven't been able to sense its location either. Oh, but I have no information on the layout of the head, the floor, and not too far from where you are. Proceed with caution. It looks like a dead end. And we still haven't found out anything about the black shadow. I was really hoping we get some clue this time. Um, anyway, we're heading over there now. Please, look around a little while you wait. Of course, we're gonna check this door. And who's we gonna see? I bet it's... Oh, maybe Yukari. Mitsuru should be less. Or Fukuyama Magisi? Mitsuru. Oh, yeah, it's Mitsuru. So this is the interior of Tartarus. It's only the second time anyone's been here without special equipment. Normal weaponry is useless against shadows. Any equipment we brought would be for your peace of mind. Everyone here has had their potential developed in our labs. That should suffice to protect us. And even if you're devoured, that in itself would be valuable data for us. <laughs> Crazy. It's not a Kutsuki, right? <laughs> Is anyone left in the Ergo Division who isn't a psycho? In any case, sir, are you all right with this? I mean, bring your daughter. I don't know what happened. Damn it. I don't mind at all. I myself requested to come along. You heard her. I see. I'm sorry to have spoken out of turn, sir. <laughs> hey, what's wrong? What the hell? He becomes shadow. Looks like it's back to the drawing board for the artificial development of potential. Sir, miss, step aside. That's a shadow. You little... Persona users do exist. Mitsuru. Father, 
I'm glad you're safe. That was wonderful! Lady Mitsuru, a beautiful expression of your natural potential. At last, our future seems bright. What? Why are you so happy about it? <laughs> now, Mitsuru can never escape from the destiny of atonement. She'll spend her life bound to our cursed legacy when she should be finding her own way. What's so bright about that? Yeah. Don't worry, father. I chose this for myself. I'll protect you, father. Mitsuru. Damn it. So that's it's how Mr. Wick and her power. I thought she was great by the lab, you know. But it's not. Her persona is awakened by herself. But maybe she he, she can answer Tartarus before her, her persona awakened before after life. I don't know. I'm sorry, it's just that seeing father before my eyes, as if he were still alive, was... Senpai. Ah, uh, but wasn't Mitsuru Senpai really cute when she was little? Yeah, Junpei. What stupid thing you would see more? Excuse me, Yori. Are you saying that's no longer the case? Uh, no. That's, that's not what I... Come on, you got it all wrong. It's exactly as I thought. What? Just tell us already. Of the past events we've seen up to this point, the first one seemed to be about getting ready for battle, but the others... How should I put it? It feels like there's some aspect they all have in common. Don't you all think so? Yes, but we can persona. Yes, but for now, we don't know what that might be. Or, yeah, preparing for the battle for Tartarus. This is the fifth door. We should be getting closer to the source we're looking for. Oh, I just remembered. There's something I have to tell you all. You just remembered now? Remember the machinery and documents Mitsuro Senpai found? I looked into them and it turns out they were things that the chairman hid when he was still alive. Most of them were from the accident ten years ago, so he must have hid them so they wouldn't be destroyed. Some of the notes I found seem to be talking about the Abyss of Time. Is that true? We may be close to discovering what this place really is. We're closing in on it. We should hurry forward. Yes. You decide to return to the log. Okay guys, I think that's it for today's video. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And yeah, just give us a comment about what you think. About a theory of this, but... Yeah, it's about what you think. No spoiler, please. Thank you and have a nice day.